Dear President Zelensky, dear colleagues, on the second anniversary of the International Crimea Platform, I wish to express Italy's unwavering support for this initiative and for Ukraine. Russia's occupation of the Crimean Peninsula in March 2014 was an unacceptable act of aggression, a clear violation of international law. Italy has constantly condemned Russia's illegal annexation of Crimea and Moscow's gradual militarization of the peninsula. We are deeply concerned for the worsening situation of human rights in the peninsula, and we stand with the Crimean Tatar community against the violence and injustice it suffers from. The fight for Crimea is part of the struggle to liberate Ukraine. Last February, Russian forces used Crimea as a launch pad for their attack on the regions of southern Ukraine, including Kherson. They continue to use Crimea to put military pressure on other areas, notably the port cities of Mykolaiv and Odessa. As Russia attempts to subjugate more parts of Ukrainian territory, the international community cannot look away. Russia must stop its illegal occupation, its brutal targeting of unnamed civilians. Italy will continue to support Ukraine. We are with you in your fight to resist Russia's invasion, restore Ukraine's territorial integrity, protect your democracy and independence. Thank you.